Hello, again I'm Jason Davis and welcome to the second tutorial video for the use of Alex. This series of video tutorials on the use of Alex, which is software for modifying your reality, are being hosted and served by YouTube. These are normally accessed from within Alex, but if you've stumbled upon any of these videos through links outside of Alex or on YouTube itself, it can be confusing. To eliminate any confusion, the thing to do is visit alex.com. That's a l i i x.com, where you can read all about Alex and download the fully functional free trial. In the last video, we covered the most basic stuff. Now let's create another intent to program your water so that once again you can experience firsthand what Alex is capable of. You know the drill here. Do you have some water handy? If not, get three or four ounces of pure or purified water. Again, your favorite bottled water is your favorite for a reason. If you need to do that now, go ahead and pause the video. If you haven't already, go ahead and prep your water the way you did before, with cleanse purify structure at 22% and 13 seconds. If you don't know what we're talking about, you probably want to stop this video and watch the first one, getting started. If you got to take a minute to prep your water, this is a good place to pause. Okay, you have your water and it's prepped and ready for programming. Is that right? Let's hope so. So, select an image. Again, if you want some time to browse through them, go ahead and hit pause. I'm going to go ahead and select the same image I usually do. Once you've selected your image, click Action, which as you found out in the previous video, activates your keyboard. And for this one, let's type Mental Clarity. And press Enter. Now click Amplitude, which produces the power output slider. For new users, we strongly recommend, for the first few weeks anyway, to keep it under 30%. If you're feeling especially adventurous, please don't push it above 40%. If you've overdone it, you'll know it. It might manifest as a detox reaction, maybe a mild or even medium that you really don't want, Maybe you do want it, I don't know. Maybe as a dull headache, maybe fatigue. If this happens, don't worry about it. Just lay off Alex for a day or two and bring your power settings down when you start up again. We'll leave duration alone for now because 13 seconds is plenty of time to program any drinking water. Now let's talk about glyph movement. These symbols can be moved and placed wherever you want them. The only criteria for this is that once again it be aesthetically or uh, aesthetically pleasing or just beautiful to you. Maybe it just makes sense. Uh, maybe it just feels right. These symbols, what we call cuneus sections, which is uh, after the ancient cuneiform alphabet, can be chained together. As you can see how I'm doing it here. These represent how you rewire yourself, creating new neural pathways as an example all the way down to the level of your DNA. This is how you do the reprogramming. Again, how these are chained together is anything that's pleasing to you. They can be set up so that it's more than just a single chain. Maybe it's several chains. After you get them placed the way you want them, sometimes I like to place these over the tops of the language themselves. It just depends on you know my mood, and I don't know, perhaps it's uh, just a private superstition of mine. Before you actually get them placed, however, you might want to check this out. Click the uh, down arrow under Nucleate, and with this slider you can globally resize all of the images in the action pane. Again, you might want to do that because it's uh, because maybe it looks a little overcrowded when you uh, get them all projected onto the action pane. 
and so on if you if you've already placed them and chained them together resizing them is actually going to change their positions a little bit so you may want to rechain them and you probably want to size it before you even begin to chain these together with the uh, the number of these available the the number of permutations that are possible is is actually just absolutely infinite I'd like to mention again that that one of the ways that your subconscious mind or what uh, you may already know we often call the meta mind communicates to you is by what is beautiful that is one of the easy ways for communication again the the only criteria is that it is that it looks great to you and uh, or that it just makes sense or that it just feels right and there's really not much more to it than that at least at this stage let's touch on saving a session under nucleate there are two pl two ways to do this one is under this menu under save session and the other is under nucleate you can save the session this way or save session and nucleate the difference between those two is that save session and nucleate once you have clicked save session and named the file it will automatically generate the session so be ready to put your attention on the water the minute that you've uh, clicked OK and that'll make more sense to you in just a minute for now we'll just do it this way save session the dialog box appears for saving the session in this case it's very simple just name it descriptively like mental clarity it'll automatically add the, fi the, the, the appropriate file extension and click save now the session is ready to be run put your attention on the water and click nucleate again it'll run through its cycle with the timer showing right here and as it nears the end of the cycle this will the whole action pane and all the imagery will begin to fade out since I already have mental clarity saved I'm going to reset Alex and will show you now how to open a session click this globe the main menu button go to open open session and select mental clarity what I'd like to show you is that now that you have them configured the way you want them on any session that you're constructing and let's go ahead and uh, and chain some of these together just randomly is that you may want to try it against some different images if you look around through them just randomly you may find one that actually fits your configuration better than the image that you had originally selected there are uh, over 300 of these images available so if you'd like to do that now go ahead and pause the video and uh, and take a look to see if uh, if any of them fit your configuration better if as an example I come upon an image that that really catches my attention what I might do is because I have two of these what we call metaglyphs on the action pane I'll probably want to bring them over and do something like this with them sometimes that might call for you know rechaining these once again how about anything you do is going to be perfect it's hard to it's impossible to be wrong on how you do this because once again it is tied to either what feels right or just what is beautiful or um, whatever if you're happy with your image again you know the drill put your attention on the water and press nucleate
Alex will program the water through the normal, the, the default 13 second cycle. The images will fade, the action panel fades, and it will be done. Drink the water and in a few minutes you'll notice that you're experiencing some pretty nice mental clarity. How long it lasts will probably also surprise you, certainly for the rest of the day. That should do it for now. Thanks for tuning in. In the next video we'll start with more of the features and functionality. Until